Hello, and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Today I'm going to be kicking off the uh, Keithis Chronicles series, which is going to be a challenge run where I'm going to beat all of Dark Souls 3 just using the Keithis, or Fist, for the first two bosses. And, uh, yeah. So, hoping to have some fun with that, chat with you guys, and lots of fun. So, I'm just going to go ahead and get my game loaded up real quick. And then I'm also going to pull up Twitch on the uh, on my computer so I can read the chat from you guys and uh, yep first I'm just gonna go ahead and start a new game yes indeed let's see we need a good name that is completely related to the case test so I'm just gonna call him so cold even though it has nothing to do with case test. perfect okay let's just uh, mess it reset Blue from favorites and cold guy. Perfect, beautiful. Okay, um, for the starting one, I'm gonna want something with a large amount of health. So let's do the warrior burial gift. Uh, for the burial gift, I'm probably just gonna go for the sovereignless. So, uh, well, yeah, yeah, let's do sovereignless. So. And finalized creation. Okay, let me just. Uh, while this is loading up, I'm gonna go on to Twitch. That all loaded up. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Perfect. Right. Just gonna let it go through there real quick. And a couple more seconds on loading in. Search back. Okay, and let's go ahead and just get started. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and take off everything, because we don't need armor. Because of course you don't need armor. Okay, just got the chat loaded up. Sorry for uh, keeping you guys waiting. Okay, well, now I'm just going to get on running with this gold, gold man. So, let's just go ahead and grab the Ashen Estus Flask. That will be helpful. Definitely want that extra Estus for Vort. So, uh gonna keep that on me. I'm also gonna probably run down and get the fire bombs for second phase because that's gonna make that a lot easier. Um, gonna want to grab the bonfire as well because I have a feeling I'm gonna die because you know I'm gonna have to be parrying like a son of a gun for this first fight. And I'm probably going to mess that up once or twice. Okay, I'm just going to run down. Roll past. Get the fire bombs and be on my merry way towards the boss fight. Off we go. In the corner. They don't. Never mind. Two. Ow. This one hit me too. Thanks a lot. This will save the bonfire because I really want the health. Um, just run up here. Bonfire. Okay, back up. Around the side. Right up, roll past, around the side, up. Get that bed night shard for later. So, plunging attack on this first guy. It doesn't kill him, but you know, it's a step in that direction. Roll past this guy. And off we go. Sure, I get all my stuff together. I'm not gonna need this, but I am gonna want this. And onward. Just uh, do minimally invasive surgery. And smack him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Harry. Off. Not a whole lot of damage, but you know, it gets the job done. 
perfect. Okay, I'm just gonna try and get a pair on this one, unless he does the grab. Thanks a lot. So can't parry that either. There we go. Finally, a parryable attack. Get a couple more smacks in on him. Get another parry in. This fight's going well so far. I'm liking this. Parry him. Get punching. Dodge. Dodge. Parry. Or buff. Perfect. Get a charge punch. There we go. Parry again. Pop again. Charge punch. Roll out of his way. Perfect. Yeah, this fight has been pretty much followed so far. Liking this. Another quick hit. Good roll. One of his parry. Perfect. Get another one. Just about second phase, not quite there, but, you know, we're close. Let's see, what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh, a little side attack? No, you don't. And get on down. Oh, this is almost flawless. <laughs> oh well. All good things must come to an end, I suppose. Okay, if this doesn't get him second phase, I don't know what will, because... He is looking free. Yep, second phase. Perfect. Let's just switch to firebomb, lock on, chuck in one of these. Four, one, two, three. And another quick firebomb. What's he doing? Another quick firebomb in. It's going up, it's going up, it's going down. Firebomb. And that attack again. Let's get another firebomb. Get back out the Estus. Hopefully he goes for the... Oh. I don't see that one too often. I haven't seen him use a tail attack in a long time. Okay. We need to stagger him. Hit him around a couple times. Go for the hand. Can we just roll through that? Punch around a couple more times. Up. And down. Couple more quick punches. And... Come on. Couple more. Give me the punches. A nice charge attack. It's two of them. Couple light attacks. Stagger them. And finish them off. That was perfect. Even though I did take one hit, that was pretty much perfect. Very happy with that. Awesome. Okay. And I will just, uh... Go ahead and run up. Open up the door. Just want to get a quick thing. Um... And onward, off to Firelink Shrine. Okay, so I'm just going to roll down here. Probably going to upgrade my health a little bit. That'd be, that'd be pretty useful. Oh, also going to want to sell that thing to the Shrine Handmaid. Uh, so let's just go ahead and do that. Sell, name a soldier. Got 5,000 souls now, so should be able to get a couple upgrades with that. Let's see couple into health. Oh, never mind. Let's just do them all into health, because, you know, I like health. Well, let's say if I was taking one of them out, so it increases two damage. Maybe an extra... Ah, now let's put them all into health right now. Okay. Name's Okay, well, let's just go ahead and put the uh, coiled sword into the bonfire. And, uh... There we go. And just sit down. And off to Highwell Lothric. So, while we're in the learning screens, I'm just going to go ahead and check the uh, chat from you guys. Let's see. 
Okay. Uh, look at all the beautiful stuff we can't use. You know, like heal aid. Can't use that. Wonderful. Let's see, what else? Undead bone shard. At least we can use undead bone shards. That's good. <laughs> yeah, definitely going to be using a lot of Estus in this run, so Glister gets to use the undead bone shards. Let's see, Karthus Curve Sword? Nope, not able to use that either. <laughs> oh, I know what I forgot to do. I guess I'll just do that once I go and grab the new Estus shard, but... I'm going to want to go talk to the blacksmith after I get the Estus shard from this area, and then we'll go fight Vort. Let's see... Definitely gonna want this bonfire. Okay. And down we go. I'm gonna grab the gold pioneer. I'm gonna use that a little bit later. Sadly, I can't use it for Vort, but I'm sure I'll find use for it later. Just run on over, head on down, and gold pioneer. And just jump on the ledge. Grab a couple of quick souls for later. Just fast him. Mm -hmm. Ah, I messed that one up. Come on. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna try and just draw the knight out towards me. Come on. Okay. Go ahead and just run up again. Light the bonfire. I can hear the guy running up here, so I'm gonna see if I can see the rest of the bonfire. I can. Cool. Let's just uh, go ahead and run on down to that Estus shard. Just come off the side. Not sure why I rolled into the barrels, but you know it felt necessary, so. There we go. Just run on past here. Run down to the crystal wizard, and now we're gonna punch him for a while. He might take some time. Because he doesn't have a ton of health, but, you know, he's a decent amount of health, especially when you're just punching him. No, do not run up. Do not run up. Please don't run up. Get back down. Thank you. Do not want to have to go deal with the, uh, giant black lizard. Oh, fudge. I had to deal with him anyway. <laughs> as soon as I say that, too. Okay, let's just try and draw him back over here. Come on, don't be shy. Perfect. Okay, let's just avoid him for right now. And head down the ladder before I die unbelievably quickly. Okay, so I'm just gonna hit by that arrow. Dang it. And just roll past this knight. Go ahead and grab the uh, green blossom, even though probably won't need it, but you know, just in case, it's there. Drink some Estus, and let's just make a mad dash for that Estus shard. There we go, Estus shard. I'm also going to try and grab the Titanite Knight shard after I heal. Let's just go ahead and do that. Perfect. Just gonna go ahead and roll past this guy if he'll let me through. Come on. There we go. Gonna roll on down. Hit the ground running. Or at least hit the ground rolling. And I'm gonna go open up the shortcut back to the first bonfire. Searcher. I think Vort's gonna like be difficult because of his health bar, but I don't think he's gonna be too bad. Because his attack bonds aren't too too hard. But you can't parry him or anything like that, so he's gonna have a lot of health, which is going to uh not be fun. But you know. Work with what we have. Also gonna go back to the shrine once I get to the bonfire, so we can get five Estus Flax. Which is uh Definitely better than having three. Especially when it's kind of an endurance fight, so. Oh, here comes the dog. Nope. <laughs> no.
No. Get behind the tree. Stay there. No. <laughs> I didn't realize you could do this to the dog. I almost feel bad. Alright. And done. Okay. Well, that was easy enough. And back to the bonfire we go. Okay. Like, as always, while I'm going on lunch, I'm just going to take a quick look on the chat. See what's going on there. Still not too much going on, but that's okay. Just, uh, put a quick message in. So, uh, let's see. Now that we're back in Firelink, let's go ahead and just give ourselves five Estes Flags. Go ahead and reinforce, and also a lot the other one. And onward. Oh yeah, also that's all we're gonna run on. Do I still, or do I? Oh, you have enough souls. Okay, let's do one of those. Forty extra health can, right? Do I have any souls I can sell? I know I picked up a couple, right? And not enough. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about them. Going to rest of the bonfire and back to High Wall of Lothric. Run down to Vort, finish him off, and uh, yeah. Hopefully, we'll be able to get that done first try, but no promises. Probably not going to need Dragon Scale Ring, but. Because none of the bosses really backstab you. Hmm. Too bad you can't put lightning resin on your fist. That would make this a lot easier. But, you know, we'll see. Maybe we'll get him first try. Maybe we won't. The elevator is there, so let's go ahead and ride that down. Send it back up. Taste this next time. And off we go. Probably gonna want to take out the fire bombs because I am not going to be using those. Okay. Go ahead and just run on over, grab the souls real quick, even though it's not worth too much, but, you know, everything helps. Run on down, run around the corner, I am in we go. I just realized that this boss fight had no roof. I never realized that before. It's like meeting one of my own. He's cold, I'm cold, everyone's cold. Except he doesn't look very happy. So, I guess that's the difference between us two. Let's just go ahead and get started. I'm just gonna run in between his legs for most of the flight, just keep smacking him around, hope for the best. Okay, that is not a lot of damage. <laughs> I was hoping for a little more. <laughs> Oh, that's fine though. Skip away at him. Yep. Skip away at him a little more. See it all. Where is he? <laughs> Catch me at that time to try and get a snap behind you. Almost got me with that poke. Just about. But not quite. No, I guess now would be a uh, good time to check the chat. So, let's see what's going on there. Okay, still not too, too much, but. Okay. Just keep smacking him around. He's looking. 
pretty pretty low health for how long we've been fighting him. It's been a pretty short fight overall. So. Okay, so how much damage are we dealing with one light? So I'm doing six damage per light. And then let's do like a heavy attack and so probably gonna wanna stick with the light attack. I'll just double check those numbers second phase. Run around side. Ooh. Okay, at least he didn't hit me with the hammer. That would have done would have done a lot more damage. Lights under a year right now, doesn't it? And he just backed up, gets some victims. No, he's gonna run back, right back up, and keep smacking him. There's no escaping the tiny man with a fist. Well, he is not quite half, but you know, he's getting there. Looking good. So, try and finish him off. I don't think this will take any more than five minutes. If I get done flawlessly, if I if I die, then it's gonna take a while, but should be fine for right now. Oh, what I forgot to test, does it do any more damage if I hit him in the head? Let's run up there in a second, but I don't see an opportunity to do so, but right now I'm not seeing it. I can help. No, it doesn't do any damage, so I guess I'll just stick to his backside. Great time to get some hits in. Okay, so I'm still doing only six. That's not great. But you know, it'll work. Quick heal in. Gonna charge, or what is he doing? Yes. Hold for a second. Yep. I'm not sure how he hit me there, but you know. Definitely he's harder on the second phase, he's kind of sliding around a bit more. Catching me a couple more times in the last phase. Oh, and he got me halfway through. That's not good. Okay, guess I'll just give this one more quick try. I think we got it this time. Just load back in. Give it another shot. Let's see what this is this way. Run on down. Might as well check the chat while I'm running. Okay. Let's see. And enough. Trying to figure out what I could use to take him out a little bit easier. I'm not seeing much. Grim Blossom's not gonna help. Mm -hmm. Just gonna scout around the area for a sec, see if there's anything that might be able to help me out a little bit. Maybe collect some souls so I can upgrade my damage. I'm not gonna need a ring of sacrifice. I'm gonna grab an ember from the bottom. Let's see. We'll sit down here. Use that ember, so that'll be good for a round or two. Okay. Yeah, I kind of got myself trapped. Good. Uh, go ahead and start running back towards the boss. Quite nice if there's something that I can use against him. Oh. Can't think of anything right now. Oh well. Go ahead and just give this guy another quick try. Give him off a little bit lower Estus, but that's okay. And then if I die, I'll just use an Ember back to Bonfire. It'll upgrade and, you know, all that good Walk on over. Hello. 
and you want to jump away immediately. You know, I probably should have put on Green Blossom in case I get from the boss, but it will make it too But, uh, shouldn't be an next run if we get this one old enough correctly. Seems to be pretty good while he's in the corner, so, and keep him in here. Okay, looks like something completely broken with his AI right now, and I'm not sure why. Okay, there we go. Now he's moving again. Good morning. <laughs> A couple more quick. Seems like two full stamina bars in zone while he's pinned at the corner, so that was very happy with that. Oh! Ooh, that almost caught me with that. We go now. Okay, slam. No, don't. No. Oh. There we go. Another overhead slime. All good. Those are pretty easy to dodge, so definitely like it when he does that. Okay, go ahead and just swing around. Smack him a couple more times in the leg. So this guy doesn't stagger, so. That's not gonna be able to help me. Almost got him second phase again though, so. He's definitely much faster than last run. I'm trying to be a little bit more aggressive with it. Oh, don't play overhead again. Good stuff. Now oh, you know you could do two overheads back to back. Definitely useful to know, especially if you didn't do that phase, gonna wanna know that. Under him again. I could do just stay in place for just a couple of seconds so I could get a couple more smacks and just one or two on him, but you know. It worked. Oh, there we go. Good opportunity to do a couple of smacks. Oh, this is pretty good. Three or four. One. Okay, so he's had not to do the follow-up on that one. And he's second phase! Sweet. Get the charge attacks going. What's wrong with- Okay, there we go. <laughs> I thought he wasn't charging. <laughs> but something messed up and he's like, you know what, I don't want to do it today. Maybe try to be a little bit less aggressive in this case. Because he seems to be quite a bit more difficult to dodge in this case. I can't fight it. It's going to be pretty bad. Yep. I like the way this run's going now. Alright, half health and only use the nest. Good start. Hoping he goes for that frost attack though, that's going to be an excellent opportunity to get him damage. That way he has not done that. Hmm, that'd get me that just there. There's the ice grab. Perfect. They have to get some quick smack. Fall him around and then put that frost in. Yep. Roll around. Every now and then I get a little bit frozen in this. Oh no. How do I always panic heal? Never do that well. Okay, so I'm pretty much one shot. So I might use an Ember if I find an opportunity. So this fight's going really well actually. Coming. Gonna charge towards me. Okay. Not sure where that charge time came out of. He like didn't do the charge and he was right, right next to me. Please, he decided he would give me the frost breath again. As long as I get frost I'll be okay. Nothing has to be terrible. How'd that hit me? I was behind him. 
Okay, well. I think that might be it for the stream today, but I will be returning on Friday for the next installment of the Casus Chronicles. So, if you did like the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Our YouTube channel is Back to Basics Gaming, and then our Twitch is Back to Basics Games. And, uh, yeah, you guys have a great day.